Hello everybody, this is Sayyad Musa Kaleem from Epicop and today I'm gonna show you one interesting app and that is more popular on internet these days and that is Stack Bliss. It's an online visual studio code IDE for uh, developing Angular and React apps. So it, it's, uh, Stack Bliss allows you to create Angular, React and Ionic apps in just a one click. It has uh, embedded Visual Studio, Visual Studio Code Editor, and it has lot, lot of features like IntelliSense, and that is present in Visual Studio Code, and it also provides hot reloading as you type, and it also allows you to import npm packages, and so that you can easily install uh, dependencies, and also it gives you the hosted app URL. This is the feature which I like really which I like most it gives you the hosted app URL so that you can share with your friends and with anyone you want it so it also keep editing while often you can make changes and you can edit your application on stack list while you are offline so we'll see how we can create our application in stack list let's go ahead and click ionic I'm gonna create a simple reference app to show you how you how it works as you can see here it looks like a Visual Studio Code IDE and here you can see our app is running it's bundling and also this is the URL hosted instant hosted URL so that you can share with your friends when I copy this and when I open this in another tab you can see my application here uh, this is the feature which I really like about stack bliss and also you can create your production apps or any app on stack bliss so we'll see now we'll jump to the pages and we'll see the home page home.html now you can see here it is home so we'll change it to epicop and you can see here hot reloading it gets changed to epicop and you can also use any ionic element inside this file you can see here it is also reloading on the browser which I have opened here these are the tabs which is in the footer about contact we have three pages inside this app and let me show you about the dependencies how you can install dependencies in stack bliss he, here we have a bunch of dependencies npm packages rxjs typescript angular core http so just you need to type your package name here so that you can install that dependency so I'll type angular fire or angular slash fire 2 installing dependencies oh it is giving some it is giving some error try installing a different package name okay so this package is not available in dependency section so we need to install any other dependencies like if you want to install any dependency then you should type here and so that you can easily install that particular dependency and here we have settings you can see we can also delete this project as well and we have different options we can open this in a new window like I shown open it opens in the same window you can make any changes and you can see the instant results it it just reloads when you edit or when you make any changes so we'll create a button here below the p tag and that button will be as you can see here it also provides the intelligence which is a beautiful feature of uh, visual studio code it, it has like I said it has embedded Visual Studio Code in it so you can use all core features of Visual Studio Code inside Stack Bliss so button 
I'll, I'll give ion button it gives all kind of feature and yeah you can see here and also we can give the button name like share or share stack bliss share stack bliss and you can also change the color of this button color equals to primary or secondary so yeah you can see here and we can also give some events click events on this button so that we can write our logic in home.ts file hope you like stackbliss and i would suggest you to start uh, creating projects on stackbliss because it has all features like visual studio code is providing you and it allows you to create all three kind of applications on three different platforms that is, that are angular react and ionic and you can also share your live project url hosted app url with your friends to see the changes and to uh, to give feedbacks to you on that particular project hope you like it and hope you enjoy this please don't forget to subscribe my channel and uh, please subscribe my channel and stay up to date with new videos thanks for watching this video and i'll see you in the next video